Hi, my name is Alex Carlucci with GustinShow.com. Uh, we do a lot of new construction loans here uh, for new homes. So let's say you want to buy a home. We're not going to do the construction loan, but let's say you, bought, you found a builder that's got a house that will dig ground if you put down like a $5,000 deposit, and then you get a pre-approval from a bank like me, and I'll write you a pre-approval. Now, one thing you have to worry about on new construction homes is um, the tax the taxes on the home. So there's no tax bill on a new home yet. So they, it looks like it's only $300 a year because there's just a piece of land there. But the underwriters are going to make you use what's called the mill rate. They're going to ask you to you know, figure it out the mill rate, which the county has that mill rate. Multiply it by it, divide it by this, get this, and blah, blah, blah. It's a really complicated formula. But it usually works out to be to 2 3% of the purchase price, which is way higher than your actual tax bill is going to be. So for a $300,000 house, they make, make you escrow for $9,000 a year taxes, qualify you for $9,000 a year tax payments. So that would be, you know, $700 almost in, in payments per month, so you have to qualify for it. So it really hurts what you qualify for when you buy new construction, so be wary of that. Um, the process is they always want you to go to their lenders, which always bums me out if you want to get any closing cost credits. So I think that's kind of a, a bad move. They, they have higher rates, they don't have good deals, and they, they make you go there to get pre-approved sometimes if you want to get closing cross crust, if you get denied by them, then they'll think about giving you closing costs with another lender. It's kind of, a, I think it's, it seems a little crooked to me, but that's how builders like to do it. They like to direct you to their lender and they want to make money on the mortgage and they want to make mortgage money on the sale of the home. So it's kind of crooked to me. Um, but be wary of that. Um, the rest of it's great. The process of closing um, new constructions, a lot of times they miss the dates and because we don't, we, because we don't we can't get the certificate of occupancy fast enough. We miss the dates. So as soon as they get that certificate of occupancy, they want to close immediately, and it takes us like a week to close. So it's really kind of complicated at the end. It gets messy. But besides that, it's a great thing. You get to move in your house, brand new. No one's ever lived there. If you qualify for the higher tax rate for that first year until it gets assessed by the county, then it's no big deal. I say go ahead, go ahead and buy it. It's a, it's a great way to get into a home. It's new construction, but be careful of a couple of these pitfalls. Those are really the only pitfalls that I see. If you got any questions, give me a call. 630-915-7550. Thanks.